Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. So basically today, so I woke up, okay? I woke up and I was like, this might be the last day that I can actually do Christmassy stuff in London because I'm gonna meet up with my friend tomorrow and then I can do something else on Wednesday but this is my only day off before I go to Greece so and then vlog must pretty much over even though I'm thinking to do until New Year's Eve and to New Year's so with New Year's Eve because my sister is gonna be here so we're gonna do Christmas stuff with her but I'm just not sure if I'm gonna be uploading every day but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be vlogging every day so stay tuned for that but basically <coughs> I woke up okay and I was like I have a friend that she sends me so many reels of like stuff to do in London especially on Christmas time and I wrote them all down and I said I'm gonna do those things not all of them but most of them I'm gonna go around London today and see all of these Christmassy, you know, places like the best hot chocolate, um, a crumble dessert. Apparently, it's like very Christmassy and just you know very good. Um, also, other like exhibitions and horse and carriage ride. So, I'm ready to go. I'm obviously going to wear something else on top, like more um, warm. Um, but it's a sunny, lovely, sunny day today. So, let's head out. I'm so excited. So, this video is going to be something like Instagram Reels. Not control my life. How do I phrase this? Anyway, I'll figure it out. But this is what I'm doing. So... Off we go! We made it to Slam and I'm trying to find the road where the horses and cars are. Okay, we made it to the Pavilion Street and I think the, the carriage is at the end of the road. So we're gonna start with the carriage. <laughs> and then the chocolate. supposed to be but I don't see any horses or carriages or any people waiting so I'm gonna wait just a little bit supposedly there should be an elf here like someone to ask um, there isn't any so let's just wait a little bit okay well that was a little bit of a fail but I got to see Pavilion Road which we're gonna go now and grab a coffee but apparently it's only on Saturdays not every day, only on Saturdays. Yes. The sun is shining. Let's find a cute coffee place. So I'm gonna try this one because I'm really hungry. So. I got um, salmon and soft cheese. Sandwich. And now we're gonna find the hot chocolate place in Victoria. So we're leaving Sloan Square. Now we're going to Victoria.
ate the pancakes and they were actually really good but I think they look better than they actually taste so it was all right I think you can feel the egg in the pancakes um, this the place was like really small I think the place is a little bit um, overrated but nonetheless it was really good and definitely go try it And now I'm walking towards Bond Street because apparently it's very Christmassy and we'll get a coffee from there, maybe, if we find a good place. It's a 25 minute walk, it was 30 minutes walk from where I left, but it's a beautiful place to walk to, like this is St. James's Park, I think, you know, the, the palace, Buckingham Palace, so... It's a nice walk. I'm thinking of buying socks as presents for people because <laughs> who doesn't like socks? I'm thinking of this for my sister unless they have socks with coffee cups <laughs> then I'm gonna get the coffee cups Oh, this is heaven, so I'm not gonna go in because I'm gonna buy this. I'm at Carnaby now, walking to the exhibition at the Now building, I think. I got some socks for um, Christmas presents. Um, look how nice that is.
basically yesterday as I was making my Pajula watch the Sofia and Sing Sia vlog and they said they're obsessed with the blank street matcha latte, the warm one. So I had to try it. Honestly so good. Oh my god. That's so good. Exactly what I needed. That was amazing! It just kept repeating after a while, so I left. And now we're gonna try a very nice thick hot chocolate. I'm really excited. Soft, soft 
soft something. Soft society. Something. If I find out. <laughs> I found it. Nice one. Oh. Where is it? I think it's in here. But I'm not sure. I'll have a look. Here we go. Stop. It looks like it's closed. <laughs> not this. Most places that I want to go today are closed, which is a bummer. But we'll find something else to drink. Another fail on my behalf. Guys, you should Google stuff before actually doing it, because that happened with me and Philip as well. We're, we wanted to do stuff and then we just, everyone was closed, so you should Google always first if they're open. Well, look at this Pepsi Max tree. Fun. Okay, let's find somewhere else to drink something. <laughs> I found a toilet. Oh my god, I was saved by the bell, like literally. One more second, I would have pulled myself. I have this thing where if I have to go pee, I have one minute to find the toilet. Otherwise, that's it. I don't know if I should look it up. Maybe I should. But anyway, I made it. <laughs> this white pine looks really good, so we're going in. I got a hot chocolate. It's organic, so they melt the happiness in it. They melt the chocolate. 7% is organic. Oh, I'm so I made it home and I think I'm gonna end this video here. Um, it was such a great experience just going out and finding new places and even though we didn't get to see everything that was on my list like Instagram places and reels that I've seen because they were closed or wrong day that was my fault you should always google before you go <laughs> um, but it was such a good experience just like going around and find new places to visit and even if you live in a small city country you know just go out especially this time of year and just have a look around and yeah even if you're on your own like obviously I'd love to have my boyfriend next to me or a friend if anyone was available but you know doing stuff on your own is good too and you don't have to count on other people to do the things that you want so with that being said thank you so much for watching and i'll see you again tomorrow i'm meeting with my friend maya you already know her and we're going i think we're going to one of her favorite places that apparently has the best matcha um i think but stay tuned <laughs> for that because I'm really excited. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye guys.